Have you ever wondered why rhinoceros, one of the largest land mammals, have horns on their noses? Rhinoceros, or rhinos as they are commonly known, are fascinating creatures with distinctive physical features that set them apart in the animal kingdom. Their horns, their thick skin, their enormous size. Each aspect plays a unique role in their survival in the wild. These majestic creatures are not just a spectacle to behold, but key players in the ecosystem they inhabit. Join us as we delve into the life journey of these magnificent creatures. The life of a rhino begins in a unique and nurturing way. The prologue to their existence is written during a gestation period that spans 15 to 16 months, a testament to the resilience and patience of the mother rhino. As the day of birth approaches, the mother finds a secluded spot, a safe haven for her and her calf. When the moment arrives, a calf, weighing around 85 to 100 pounds, makes its entrance into the world. The calf is delicate, its skin not yet hardened into the iconic armor of adulthood. Yet, from the moment of birth, the young rhino is anything but helpless, standing and feeding within the first few hours of life. The mother rhino, a gentle giant, bestows her love and protection unconditionally. She guides her calf, teaching it to navigate the vast wilderness, always watchful, always present. From a vulnerable calf to a robust juvenile, the journey of growth begins. Survival in the wild is never easy, especially for a young rhino finding its way. When a baby rhino steps into adolescence, it faces a series of challenges that test its mettle and shape its destiny. First off, the adolescent rhino is thrust into a world riddled with predators. Lions, hyenas, and crocodiles all see a young, inexperienced rhino as a potential meal. The adolescent rhino must quickly learn to use its greatest weapon, its horn, to fend off these threats. It's a trial by fire, where only the quick learners survive. Finding food presents another challenge for the budding rhino. As herbivores, rhinos rely on a diet of grass, leaves, shoots, and bark. The adolescent rhino must learn to forage for these resources, often competing with other herbivores for the choicest tidbits. It's a challenge that demands resilience and sharp instincts. Then there's the matter of learning to use their horn. This isn't just for fighting off predators. The rhino's horn is a multi-purpose tool, used for digging up roots and breaking branches, aiding in the food quest. Mastering the use of the horn is a key survival skill for the adolescent rhino. Social behavior is another aspect of the rhino's adolescence. Rhinos are generally solitary creatures, but adolescents often form groups with other young rhinos, learning from each other and offering mutual protection. Interaction with other species is also a part of the rhino's social education. Elephants, buffaloes, and even birds can be part of the rhino's social sphere, each interaction teaching the rhino valuable lessons about coexistence. The adolescence of a rhino is a journey of survival, learning, and growth. It's a period that shapes the rhino, preparing it for the trials of adulthood. The young rhino must navigate predators, find food, master its horn, and learn the intricacies of social interaction. It's a tough world out there, but the adolescent rhino doesn't shy away from the challenges. Despite the challenges, the young rhino perseveres, maturing into a formidable creature. As an adult, the rhino becomes a true titan of the wilderness. A rhinoceros in its prime is an imposing figure, a majestic creature that commands respect from all who share its environment. Its sheer size and strength are awe-inspiring, but the adult rhino is far more than just a symbol of power. It's a keystone species, playing a critical role in shaping the ecosystem it inhabits. The rhino's daily routine is a testament to its important ecological role. With a diet consisting primarily of leafy plants and shrubs, the rhino is a natural lawnmower, keeping vegetation levels in check. This not only maintains the landscape, but also facilitates the survival of smaller species that benefit from the open spaces it creates. But the rhino's ecological impact doesn't stop there. As it wanders its territory, it disperses seeds through its droppings, contributing to the propagation of various plant species. The watering holes and mud wallows it frequents are also frequented by a host of other animals, making the rhino a crucial part of the intricate web of life. The adult rhino's life isn't solely about consumption and contribution. It also has a complex social structure, often misunderstood due to their solitary nature. Rhinos communicate through a combination of vocalizations, body postures, and chemical signals. 
Their social interactions are particularly noticeable during their intriguing mating rituals. The courtship dance between a male and female rhino can last several days, filled with tender moments that defy their rugged exterior. In stark contrast to the rhino's formidable presence, it's worth noting that these animals are generally peaceful, unless threatened. They exhibit an incredible level of patience and tolerance, particularly towards their young. The bond between a mother rhino and her calf is heartwarming, highlighting the softer side of this mighty beast. The adult rhino is a marvel of nature, a creature of strength, resilience, and surprising gentleness. It is an essential cog in the wheel of life, shaping the environment, nurturing its young, and standing as a symbol of the wild's enduring spirit. The adult rhino, a true testament to nature's resilience and strength. Even the mighty rhino faces threats that challenge their survival. As resilient and robust as these creatures may seem, rhinos are under siege. The primary threat they face is from poaching, driven by the illicit demand for their horns. Rhino horn, believed in some cultures to have medicinal properties, is more valuable than gold on the black market. This unfounded belief has led to the ruthless hunting of rhinos, pushing them to the brink of extinction. Another significant challenge is habitat loss. As human populations expand and the demand for land grows, rhinos are losing their homes. Forests are being cleared for agriculture, settlements, and infrastructure, leaving rhinos with fragmented and isolated habitats. This not only reduces their living space but also makes it easier for poachers to find and kill them. But all is not lost. There's a silver lining, a ray of hope in the form of conservation efforts. Governments, nonprofit organizations, and individuals are working tirelessly to protect and preserve these magnificent creatures. One of the key strategies has been to establish rhino sanctuaries and national parks. These protected areas provide a safe haven for rhinos, away from the threats of poaching and habitat destruction. In these reserves, rhinos can roam freely, breed, and thrive. Simultaneously, there's the fight against poaching. This involves strengthening law enforcement, raising awareness, and reducing demand for rhino horn through education. Efforts are also being made to rehabilitate and reintroduce rhinos that have fallen victim to poaching. The journey is tough, the road is long, but the will to save these unique creatures is strong. Each rhino saved is a victory, a step towards restoring the balance of our ecosystem. After all, every creature, no matter how big or small, plays a vital role in the grand tapestry of life. The fight for the rhino's survival is a fight for the balance of our ecosystem. As with all life, the rhino's journey concludes in a poignant yet important way. In the wild, the average lifespan of a rhinoceros stretches from 40 to 50 years. It's a life that's filled with encounters, challenges, and moments of tranquility. And when their time comes, as it does for all living creatures, their bodies return to the earth, providing nutrients and sustenance for a host of organisms. It's a humbling reminder of nature's interconnectedness, of the delicate balance that is the circle of life. The death of a rhino is not the end, but rather a continuation of life in a myriad of forms. Their remains serve as a vital source of nourishment for scavengers and decomposers, contributing to the health of the ecosystem. From the smallest insects to the largest predators, like lions and hyenas, the demise of a rhino plays a significant role in the survival of several species, illustrating the interconnected web of life that thrives in our world's wilderness. And while the rhino's physical form may fade away, their genetic legacy lives on through their offspring. Each new generation carries on the genetic traits of their parents, ensuring the survival of their species and continuing the cycle of life. This cycle, this beautiful ebb and flow of life and death, is the heartbeat of the natural world. Each beat, each life, and each death is a testament to the resilience and adaptability of life on Earth. Yet it's important to remember that the circle of life is not merely a process of birth, growth, and death. It's a cycle that's influenced by the actions of every organism within it, including us humans. As we've seen, the survival of the rhino is intrinsically linked to the health of the ecosystem and the survival of other species. When we take steps to protect these magnificent creatures, we're not just ensuring their survival, but the health and vitality of our shared ecosystem. The circle of life is a dance of delicate balance, a symphony of birth, growth, death, and rebirth. 
It's a cycle that's been in motion for billions of years, shaping and molding life on Earth in all its diverse forms. The rhino, with its imposing presence and gentle nature, is a vital part of this cycle, a symbol of the strength and resilience of life in the wild. And so, the life of the rhino, a testament to nature's cycle, continues with the birth of new calves. It's a journey that's as ancient as time itself, a dance that will continue to unfold long after we are gone, a testament to the enduring power of life.